hi everyone welcome to my channel today i will show you how to design shoes banner in photoshop first i will create a document 2000 by 2000 i will keep the measurement in pixel now i will give 300 resolution and i will change the color mode to rgb color now I will create a rectangle now I will change the fill color to white and then I will number this to color here I will use this image I will keep the PSD file in the description box and then you can download it for free now I will select this image that's why I am going to edit then free transfer now I will increase the size of this image I will keep this texture under the rectangle. Here I will use light pink color. That's why I am going here and fill in light in this color for this at 0 B D C 1. Now I will decrease the opposite of this rectangle. I will give 50 now I will select this all by pressing ctrl shift and now I will group this all by pressing ctrl G now I am going to rename this in background now I will lock this one now I will draw circle by holding or shift key I will keep this one in the center. Now I will use this image. I will decrease the insights. So I'm going to edit then free transfer. Now I will double click on the images. Now I will click on the image and create the image. Now I will draw another circle under this one by pressing all shift key. Now I will change the fill color to dark pink. This color code is BF2E61. Now I will name the stock color. I will keep this rectangle under this ellipse. Now I will align it. Now I will copy this one by pressing Ctrl J. Now I will select the rectangle and then reduce the size of it. Now we change this ellipse color to light pink.
I'm going to group this all by pressing Ctrl Shift and then Ctrl G for group. I, I will rename this one image. Now I will do another ellipse by pressing Alt Shift key. I will keep this red color down pink. Now I am going to copy this illusion by pressing Ctrl Z. I am going to select this one. Now I will decrease the size of it and put it in the align. I will change this fill color to one and stop color to me. Now I will type here. Here I will use Mavis new font. I will increase the size of the text. Now I will change the text color to dark green, dark pink. Now I will copy this one by pressing Alt Shift key. I am going to rename this. Now I will align this two. And put it in the center. I am going to copy this and group this all. And then in this sequence here. Now I will type here new no arrival. Now I will increase the size of the text. I'll keep it in the center. Here I will use outer blue. That's why I'm going to double click on the text. And then out of the I will keep the opacity 80 and then spread will be 90 and size will be 20. Then size two. The blend mode is the screen. Here, blend mode is screen. Now I will draw a rectangle. I will change the pink color. I will non the stroke color. Here I will use this one.
I will decrease the size of text. copy this one by pressing alt shift key and rename this Like select this all and then I'm going to group this by pressing control G. Rename this text. Now we'll draw some ellipse. I will now the fill color and keep the stock. And I will keep the size. I'm going to copy this one back to small shift. I'll change this list of color to white. Now I will create another document 2000. Now I will select this all by pressing Ctrl A and then I will copy this by pressing Ctrl Shift C. Now I will paste here by pressing Ctrl A. Now I will select this and Now I will copy this and press in Ctrl I will keep this one on the first row. Now I will select it. Now I will increase the size of it. Then I will draw a rectangle. I will keep this rectangle here. Now I will change the fill color to dark pink. Now I'm the stop color. Now I will decrease the opacity of this rectangle. I think this is perfect. Here I will apply and drop shadow just now. Double click here. Now I will decrease the size. Now I will draw some rectangle. Now I will change the fill color to white. Keep then is the color now. I will keep this one on the image. Now I will copy. 
this one back this is alt shift key oh. This is for today. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.